In, in verse 50, Jesus says this again to the woman, your faith has saved you. Go in what? Come on, somebody. Peace. In other words, Listen, you don't go in pieces, you go in peace. When, when you ask God to forgive you of your sin, he doesn't just sew up the holes. No, 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 no. He takes that sin and that shame and that brokenness and he gets rid of it. He takes it out of your life. Again, the prophet Isaiah said it this way. He gives a garment of praise instead of a spirit of despair. Like, Think about that. This is what God, what God wants to do for you today. He wants to remove your sin. He wants to remove your despair. Like where you would look down, you would say, holy smokes, this ain't me anymore. This is me now. And you're like, how is that even possible? It's possible because of the cross. It's possible because this man, Jesus, the religious leaders who said, who is he? He is the Messiah. He is the son of God. It's like this old hymn. I can't help but think about the old hymn that says, what can wash away my sin? Nothing, nothing but the blood of Jesus. What, what can make me whole again? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Man, oh, precious is the flow that made me white as snow. No other fount I know, nothing but the blood of Jesus. You, my friend, today, God wants you to come to him in repentance, and he desires to restore you today.